Hey guys, so today a craft update slash charm update. So I'm gonna be showing you the Palmer Clay Creations first, so let's get started. So first, inspired by Christ Bunnies, I made her four back to school books. So I have Sakul Kappa, I think that's the character. Virakuma, whoopsies. His mouth kind of got messed up during baking, but he's still fine. And I just dropped another one. Um, Kirai Tari. And Nyanko Cat. I don't know the other, the first word. But, yeah, it's Nyanko Cat. Um, next I have a Min in Pink ice cream scoop, which are my two favorite colors from Fimo, and I just decided to make them into one little ice cream scoop, and I actually want this to be a real life ice cream scoop. I had to hurry up because I had swimming lessons, so yeah. And um, just like last time, I made some more My Little Pony cupcakes, so I only have three, and there are the Cutie Mark Crusaders, so um, I saw a fan-made picture with them having their Cutie Marks, so I have Sweetie Belle. Scootaloo, and I just use Scootaloo's old cutie mark, like the old Scootaloo, and I have Apple Bloom. So yeah, and I also have some other cupcakes, but they're not My Little Pony, so I'm just going to show you them. I have this one. I know you can't see my lighting, it's very bad. Um, this one. And this one, which is pretty messy. There's like tea loss all over the um, cupcake base. Nice and inspired by Soul Craftastic. I made this charm. I did not use any cookie cutters or anything or silicone. And I just made everything with clay. And it's kind of, I guess it's pretty cute. I don't really know. Next I have a, another one of those dollops. And this was a rainbow one. It's just a capuchon. And then I have a peapod. And I see I got this idea from a really old video of mine when the only seven zero one said, You could make one of the peapods a boy and a girl. So I decided to make one with a little hair tie and one with a little bow tie. And so yeah. Next I have this little panda. It's inspired by one of those um cookie not cookie, um DIY Japanese candy kits, those little um I don't know what they are actually, but I made this and it's so adorable. I love this panda so much. I want to wear it for like the first day of school, so yeah. And then I have two cheapies. So I have a this girl and she's kind of in like a gym uniform with the sword on, which is very weird. Um, she's from Girls High. I don't know what her name is, but she's the rival of one of the girls. I forgot. I haven't watched Girls High in a while. And I don't feel like watching it because I'm too busy watching free. But, yeah. And then I have this chibi girl, which is, like, one of my favorite chibis now. Um, so here it is. I can't really steal you, but she has curly hair. And her hair is textured. I don't know if you can see. And she just has curly hair. She reminds me of one of my classmates from school. But, yeah. <laughs> Next, I have pens for back to school. So, I'm just going to show you them. I have a, a Fluttershy one. I don't know if you can see because it's very blurry. But there are her two, like her butterflies and it's just yellow. The paper was kind of short so it didn't go all the way there. But yeah, I have that one. And then I have a polka dot one. It has like mint and other colors in there. I have a Oyasumi Bakura. I don't know if you can see the Oyasumi Bakura in there. That's what he, where he is. And then I have this character. I actually have no idea what the name of this character is. But these pens are inspired by Momo's Cafe. I just loved her tutorial. And I'm just going to bring these to school. And whoopsies. I have my own customized pens. Because nobody in my class is going to be like obsessed with like any Japanese characters like me. And then I have a Mamagoma one. I have a Kawaii Cupcake one. A Lerakuma. Oopsies, I said it kind of funny. Lerakuma. I have a Panda, which is one of the new characters in um, Sanex. I think it's Kokopa, and I love the little Panda. Yes, I, I love pandas and bunnies. 
And I have another cupcake or muffin one. Um, this one I actually made three of these and I gave two away because I had to make two more because my family requested for some. And I have, lastly I have a sentimental circus one and it just has chapeau and um, the other character down here. I wanted to have the elephant but yeah. And I have two more crafts. I have these little milk cartons inspired by paper pastels and I love how cute these things are it even says paper pastel forms so this is my first one it's pretty wrinkly I haven't done paper crafts in like so long so that was my first one and then I decided to remake it and here's my oopsies. here's my remake remake one and as you can see it's a lot less wrinkly than the other one so, yeah, that's my craft update, everybody. I hope you enjoyed it. Please comment, rate, and subscribe. And if you have any charm ideas, please comment down below. So, yeah, bye.